New this morning throughout the pandemic, we've seen how school is more than just a building for learning. It can be a true resource for internet, food and more. And 10 News reporter Megan Woods joins us live this morning to tell us how Roanoke students will soon be able to do their laundry. Megan, good morning. Good morning. So Roanoke City Public Schools is working to break down some of those barriers kids are up against when it comes to limiting their success in the classroom and not having clean clothes is one of them. Laundry, a simple task on a to do list can be a heavy load for students in Roanoke who are going through homelessness. We're getting close to having um, 500 students uh, for this school year, which to me is amazing. Even during this time of pan the pandemic, when a lot of people haven't been moving as much, there's been, you know, that um, moratorium on evictions. So when the Roanoke Bar Association came to the district with the money to help, the idea came to close the gap by adding washing machines and dryers. If, if children don't have clean clothing and they don't have those resources, they're not going to come to school. I mean, that, that's something that's very difficult for any student, I think especially as you get into middle and high school. They've been able to place 16 new washers and dryers into schools. Two are at Patrick Henry High School, where counselor Kavon Fields sees the need. This is an opportunity to empower our students to feel like this is something that will help them be successful. This isn't just for homeless students. It includes those who may not be as vocal about their need. They're going to hear about it, hopefully. Someone else will hear about it and share it with them, and then that's an, another way that they'll have you know, another resource to remove a barrier that might prevent that uh, regular attendance. And with every load, staff hopes students will know how much the community truly cares. We can now provide them one more um, thing to just say, this is not a reason why you shouldn't be in school. This is why you should be in school. The goal is for every school in the district to have a washer and dryer set and you can help whether that's donating money, laundry detergent or a list of other things. We'll have that information on our website WSLS.com later today. Live in the newsroom, Megan Woods, 10 News, working for you.